We're gonna win twins, we're gonna score. We're gonna win twins, watch that baseball soar. Crack out a home run, shout a hip hooray. Cheer for the Minnesota Twins today. Season 2, Episode 4, MLB The Show 21 for your Minnesota Twins franchise. How you doing, everybody? Eric, I'm in Twins 20. It's been at least two months since the last episode. Episode 3. Yeah, it was back on September 21st. I'm looking at it right now. God, it's been a, two months, and I've just been not... Had no drive to play any baseball with the real twins stinking up the joint. And <laughs> real twins in real life right now making some lackluster roster moves to get to the 40-man roster. No free agent moves yet, and probably won't be doing any free agent moves yet. Um, I've just been not interested in doing any baseball videos in general or MLB The Show. So, you know, I just did the update, the uh, the channel update in one of my vlogs about games I'm adding, games I'm backing off on. And this is one of them. I just, I just don't have the drive. I don't have the drive for it. Uh, let's take a look at the calendar. We're in the middle of the season. We just started. Uh, we beat the Astros last time. And uh, let's take a look at the team real quick. And uh, I'll show you guys what we're dealing with here. We have Miles Straw on left. Trevor Story is our shortstop. Matt Chapman third. Cespedes our DH. Sanoza D at first. Jimmy Kerrigan is our center fielder. Uh, Rossman is our, 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 our catcher. And we have Larnick in the right. Royce Lewis in, in uh, at second. Um, and uh, I believe... Kirloff got sent down. Nick Gordon got sent down. Uh, just They just weren't cutting it. And uh, let's take a look at pitching. Uh, we have Tyler Glass now, Barrios Alcantara, Eduardo Rodriguez, and we picked up Justin Verlander, and Zach Grinke's in the long man rotation. Johan. Duran, Stajak, Riley Thompson, I believe that's a rule five pick that we got. Uh, Tyler Rogers, Taylor Rogers, excuse me. Miguel Castro and Robert Asuna are closers. So um, I think what we're going to do is I'm going to, just because I just don't have any interest in this and because I'm just so busy with my plate full already with the... Um, other games I got on the channel, GTA 4, and the DLCs that are gonna be, I'm going to be showcasing after I finish the storyline, which is going to be a while, because GTA 4's storyline is so big. And then the house flipper with the luxury flipper update I got to do. Um, I'm just I'm just burned out from baseball, to be honest. And um, I think I'm just going to start fresh, if the Twins give me a reason to start fresh. Because I'm honestly just burned out from them. <laughs> now I see it up there. I changed the Indians to Rockers, and now I know that's actually the Guardians, and need to fix that again, which ain't gonna happen. So I think what we're just gonna do, I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna sim. Um, we're gonna just sim the season, just see how it goes. Um, we'll go to, the, let's go to the, let's go to the before the the All Star break and just see how they do. And we'll just let the computer do all the do all the moves, because I at this point don't care. I just want to get this over with. And I'm sorry if some of you enjoy have enjoyed the series. It's just I'm per honestly I'm just burned out. I'm just I don't um I just don't care. Uh, I haven't played this in so many months, and it's, I'm just burned out from baseball. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna make everything auto. I'm gonna let the computer. Do it all. Uh, trades I'm gonna leave off though. Free agent I'm gonna leave. Manual contracts are gonna be manual. Drafting can they can just yeah. I'm gonna manual that. And yeah. Yep. Apply changes. And we're just gonna go ahead. And we're gonna go to mid season. 
to the home run derby and just just see what happens because I'm so burned out guys uh, I'll call we waived 26 year old relief pitcher Jorge Alcala and Cincinnati picked him up that's well that's the breaks when you let the computer decide moves you're gonna get burned uh, we're at 15 16 wins not looking too hot I'm assuming I'm gonna guess we've got injuries that are taking place three games above 500 and uh, today is the first year player draft you can just simulate it don't care don't care looks like Barrios is having a tough year of course in real life Barrios got traded to Toronto so I mean when this was going on and I had a thing to prove you know Red Sox acquire Reynolds Brian Reynolds from the Pirates okay Rockers acquire Frazier. Oh, great. Dodgers acquire Meadows from the Expos. When this was going on, I had a lot of interest in the Twins, and just now I just don't care anymore. Wander Franco goes to the Cubs from the Expos. The Expos looks like they're tearing down. Uh, we're going to stop simulating. We'll see how we're, if we got any guys in the home run derby. Who is in the home run derby? It's okay. Monday morning, and welcome to Inside the Show. In the AL Central, the Twins launched three home runs as they beat the Blue Jays in Toronto 3-2. to two. Look at that. Heading into the day, the Blue Jays Are you sit kidding in second me? place in the American Frickin League Byron East Blackson. Division. And the Twins sit in first place in the American League Central Division. We're in the first place. The Chicago White Sox combined to give up just we five games hits up. as nice. they defeated the visiting Tigers 4-1. to one. At the start of the day, the White Sox are in second place in the AL Central, while the Tigers are fourth in the division. The Rockers smacked 15 team hits as they beat the Royals in Kauffman Stadium 8-2. As of today, the Royals sit in last place in the American League Central Division. Sean Manaya grabbed the victory his fourth of the year as the Expos got the win against the Yankees 6-2. In the standings, the Yankees are leading the AL See how we're doing here. John Means won the game, Surge finishing third. a complete game one hitter, Saints helping lead the fourth. Orioles to the win over the fifth. Mets. Three nothing. Two, His three, ERA four, is currently yeah, in the top five in the American League. Heading into the day, the Orioles are in last place in the AL East, and the Mets sit atop the NL East. The Astros pitched well, allowing only three hits as they got the best of the Athletics, seven to two. Entering oh, Brios is 9-3. I thought he was 3-9. I thought I saw 3-9. I was wrong. Are atop the division. Okay. That's the Los Angeles Angels changes Manaheim things. Pitched well Eduardo's not doing good. We can do better. The win over the Mariners, Where's... Two to one. As of right now, the Mariners sit in last place in the Where's... American West Division. While the Angels Verlander. Is he... The Red Sox allowed only five He's not here. Did they release him? But they released him. They got him in double A. The double a. The Rangers are in Why? Fourth place in the AL West, and the Red Sox Whatever. are in fourth place in the AL East. The Washington Nationals totaled 11 hits as I'm they beat the Braves in Atlanta 6-3. It. At the start of the day, the Braves not are in second all. place in the NL East, while the Nationals... Let's see what happens. Nope. Nope. Nope, don't care. Okay, let's see how we finish the season. Stop, stop. Oh, today's trade line. Would you like to stop? Yes, I would. I want to see what we got. Let's see if we can get some trip pitching here. Well, this is it. The final day of the season for teams to make trades. There could be a flurry of action oh. as the day goes on. But before we get there, here's a recap of what went down yesterday. Starting in the American League Central, the Reds held the opposition at bay with only four hits as they grabbed the win over the visiting Twins, 7 to nothing. The New York Yankees tallied five home runs overall as they beat the White Sox on the south side, 9 to 5. The Rockers knocked out 10 hits as a team as they took down the Tigers in Detroit. Third four baseman and short stop. Carlos Correa swung the bat well with three hits hmm. as the Strohs disposed of the Royals 4-3. to three. They continue to win as they now have nine straight. 
Vladimir Guerrero Jr. smacked a home run and drove in three as the Blue Jays got the W over the Phillies 7-5. He is among the American League leaders in home runs. The Bo Sox combined for four total home runs as they beat the O's in Baltimore 7-6. The Angels combined for a four hitter as they were winners over the Athletics. Four to two. Wow, they got the a lot Seattle of players. The Seattle Mariners went deep four times as they got the win in a laugher against oh, the Rangers. All, oh, this is all. My bad. Two. Julio Urias grabbed the victory with his 10 Ks as the Dodgers got the best of the Braves four to nothing. Why did this jump the all of a sudden? snapped their five game losing streak as they grabbed the win against the Expos three to two. The Nationals hit three long balls huh. as they took care of the Mets at City Field, eight to four. The Pittsburgh Pirates grabbed 13 hits in the game as they bested the Cubbies at Wrigley Field, seven to six. Dallas Keuchel, the That's Giants the White Sox. sent Don't three balls into the seats as they beat the Cardinals on the road, six to two. The Rockies got 12 hits in this one as they made it a laugher against the Diamondbacks, seven one. Danny Duffy pitched well, earning his ninth win of the season, leading the Brewers to a win over the Padres, five to three. And that's the show. The trade deadline is only hours away, so don't forget to check in tomorrow for a full recap of the day's events. Who did they, wait a minute. Who did they want? That was the Mets. We're going to get some pitching here. Mets, they want third base and short. Okay, let's see what we got here. I think we have a third baseman we can give them. Hey, we take that trade. Uh, who do we got for pitching that's not doing hot here? think let's see what his he's f one and one Rodriguez seven and nine is Whiteley with the twins yes he is Who else do they have for pitching? They have DeGrom. Who's, how's he doing? 14, oh, 14 and 3. If I give them uh, Blazovich and Whiteley, I'll give them. I want. I need some help. We think we should be getting more value. <laughs> Jackasses. Okay. Well, they definitely like. We think we should be getting more value. Okay, let's see what they got. Uh, this is Nico. You want Nico? Nope. Yeah, they want. Here, have Austin Martin. I don't. Wow, they want more. Okay. Uh. I don't think I have anybody that I can give. Puig. Oh, if I give Alex, no, they can't have Alex Kirloff. Nope. They, okay, well, what if I take off this guy? I think we should be getting more, oh yeah, yeah. Who can we get? Where's Mateo playing? He's with the Twins? That okay. I want to get... I need pitching. This is ridiculous. You just don't want to give him up. Okay, well, we're going to go somebody else here. 11 to 4. Tijan. Okay. I'm giving up Mateo. Okay, so we got some pitching. All right, so we just fixed our starting pitching. All right. Sounds good. Sweet. All right. Let's go to the end of the season. See if it helps. Brewers are... Acquire Moncada from White Sox. Good. Get him out of our division. I like it. Twins acquire Tijon Walker from the Mets. That's, yep, just did that. Is it going to be enough to get us into the world, or into the playoffs at least? Looks like we're on a nice little run here. 74 and 43. Looking somewhat good here. 
Not looking good there. Still got a whole month to go. Looks like we're going to finish above 500, so that's a good thing, I guess. Uh, I'm liking what I'm seeing here. We're gonna finish with 90 wins. I think we got the division. Saints finished their season, didn't make it. Wind Surge didn't make it. No, we don't need to stop. And we finish 97-65, won the division, taking on the Yankees. Oh, of course, we are. <sighs> yeah, we're going to finish. Let's get to here at least. All right, we'll take a look at the stats. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Inside the Show, your source for all postseason news. Here's a recap of yesterday's playoff baseball. For Game 1 of the National League Division Series, the New York Mets got 11 hits overall as they got the best of the Brewers at home, 6-2. to two. They now lead the series 1-0 heading into Game 2. In Game 1 of the NL Division Series, the Dodgers put together 10 total hits as they bested the visiting Padres, 9-5. They now lead the series 1-0 ah, heading into Game 2. And that's all for today's show. See you back here all tomorrow right, for another postseason recap. Beat them one game one, lost game two. Yeah, we're gonna lose this in New York, uh, of course. Oh, we game five, of course. Taking on the Astros. Okay, here we go. Lost game one, lost game two. Lost game three, one game four, one game five. Interesting. Yeah, it's over. So we lost in game six. And that's going to be the season. And I'm going to stop it here. Dodgers beat the Astros in the World Series. So, I mean, we got to the playoffs, so we turned the Twins into... Hi there, into everyone. Welcome to this special postseason edition of Inside the Show. For game four of the Major League Baseball World Series, the Los Angeles Dodgers got a win over the Astros in Houston, sweeping their way to a World wow. Series championship. Good. It has been an incredible year for them and a dominant postseason run. I think we'll they won see last they year too. Do it again next year. So the Dodgers knock off the the Cheatriots. Oh, excuse me, the, the the Asterix. I mean the Astros in four. So that's nice. So we lost to the eventual losers of the Super of the uh, World Series. Um, even though we didn't finish this to a World Series win for us, I would say it's a successful rebuild if you call it that way we got the team from the laughing stock one of the worst teams in the league to back in the playoffs beat the yankees broke the 0 for 18 streak finally in the play postseason uh let's take a look at that raw calendar again so let's take a look so the twins went oh yeah we broke it over right away so we we beat the yankees finally breaking it then we lost two in a row and then we won three straight or two straight to beat them and then we won, we lost three in a row. And then we won games three and four, or excuse me, four and five. One, two, three. No, we go, yeah, we won four and five and then lost in game six of the ALCS. But you know what? That's, I think that's a good turnaround for the Twins and something that we could have looked forward to to season three. But like I said, I'm burned out from playing this game. I got other games I'm just more interested in. So we're just going to end it here. Whether I add MLB The Show 22 is up in the air right now. At this point, I don't see it happening, but you never know. Things have changed. The Twins could make a run, could have a decent team next year, and then and might get my juices flowing, but that's not going to happen until once the regular season, the real regular season, if there's a regular season, uh, gets underway and the Twins do good. Um, right now, it's not looking good for baseball. The uh, CBA expires December 1st, and there's talk of a lockout, and it could be very lengthy. And if the Twins don't do anything, which doesn't sound like they're going to, it's going to be another long year. So I might be taking, a, taking an, ex an extended leave of absence from this game just because I'm just bored and I just want to play other games. So I apologize for the way the series ended. Just it's I'm just being honest. I just don't have the juices flowing right now in this. I just have no interest. So... I have other games of interest I want to play, so I'm probably going to sack this series, and if it comes back, it'll be with MLB The Show 22, if that happens. So hopefully you like the series. Sorry for the disappointing end, but 
it's time to move on. If you like this episode, hit the like button, leave a comment if you like, subscribe to the channel. If you'd like to help out with future projects or upgrades to the channel, add new games, help with the hardware, you can visit my Patreon at patreon.com slash mntwins28. You don't have to help, but any help is greatly appreciated. Until the next video, peace out, and go Twins.